Hey guys, welcome to Atari Newsline. This episode we're going to be taking a look at Blockum Sockum, which is released today for the Atari VCS. This is a uh, cool game put out by Second Dimension and none other than John Hancock, who is a friend of the channel. He's been on the show before. So this episode we're going to go over a little bit of information about the game and also play a cool video about it. So stay tuned for Atari Newsline. You are, you are watching, watching Ballistic, Ballistic Coffee, Coffee Boy. Boy. Welcome back, you guys. BCB here, your host. So it was announced on April 3rd that uh, Blockum Sockum would be coming to the Atari VCS. This is a homebrew game by John Hancock in Second Dimension. Let's take a look at this on Twitter. Atari VCS posted, If you like blocks and puzzles, then the immortal John Hancock has you covered with Blockum Sockum, which has been ported to the Atari 7800, coming to the VCS on April 5th. And this is some cool news, guys. I wanted to also show you uh, uh, some information here on Atari I.O. It says John Hancock Atari Jaguar Homebrew Blockum Sockum now available for free. And this was posted last July. And Rick posted, Retro Gaming YouTube legend John Hancock's Genesis Homebrew Blockum Sockum has been ported to the Atari Jaguar. Not just ported, but also improved. The ROM has been available for free by our friends over at Atari Age. And here's a link here. I'll put it down below. It works great with emulation or if you have a Jaguar game drive cart. It's a puzzle game and it looks like a lot of fun. All due credit to the Jaguar community at Atari Age. Please don't post the ROM file here or anywhere else. Provide a link to Atari Age instead. Check out the video here. And here's a video. I'll put this link below, but playing on the Jaguar, John Hancock's video. Um, so pretty cool. Um, so also, if you go look on the internet at um, swlovinist.itch.io, this is John Hancock's itch.io page. Um, it says how to play and this is of course talking about the Genesis version um, So there are several versions of this. There's a Genesis version. I think there's even an NES version. There's a um, a uh, Jaguar version of course and now a 7800 version So it says here destroy boxes by throwing the box you're holding at the same color boxes If you hit another block of a different color after one or more blocks have been destroyed You'll swap blocks Get the block counter down to the goal or lower without running out of throws to move on to the next level. If you have no valid throws, you'll receive a penalty and will get a star block to be able to target any block on the game board. So this was released in uh, 2022. Um, so uh, you can purchase it here, of course, for $467. Um, but um, it's available today on the Atari VCS. So what we're going to do is show you a little video of this, the 7800 version. Here you go. The Foreseen Arcade. Active.
awesome guys let me know what you think about that i'm stoked about this for sure um it's cool to see these homebrew games coming out on the bcs that people have made including john hancock and second dimension and others so let me know what you think down below about this um just can't wait to play this on the bcs here it is on the atari jaguar and uh yeah let me know what you think it's been a busy atari news week guys sorry about all the updates but i want to keep you informed about all the latest also tonight, make sure to check out Unboxed, Episode 40, Staycations, Palm Tops, and Atari 400 Minis. So Ape Bubba makes an appearance in this as well. Um, we unbox some cool stuff, such as the HP Palm Top, uh, my first uh, color computer from, from Radio Shack and Tandy, and also my 400 Mini. I showed that clip again. Talk about Tandy Center Mall in Fort Worth and the Boogie Ball. We'll take a look at this coming up tonight. Stay tuned for that. Also on the channel this Sunday, I've got a cool episode as well, um, and this is uh, really near and dear to my heart. Uh, this is uh, going to be Lamasoft, the Jeff Mentor Story, Part 3. And in this, I actually uh, do a complete talk through of the game and gameplay. I play the game and read everything on the screen and show all the videos. So right now, I'm on Part 3. This is Chapter 2, The Harriers, and it's pretty cool. We start talking about... Um, how furry beasties begin to appear in Mentor's games and how he becomes fascinated with them. And uh, his business takes off. So pretty cool. Make sure to stay tuned for that. Part 4 will be the following Sunday. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Get your Java, be a good person, and go play some Block'em Sock'em. We'll see you guys later. Bye now. You are watching Ballistic Talk on Radio. You are, you are watching, watching Ballistic, Ballistic Coffee, Coffee Boy. Boy.